FCC held a massive rally in Vancouver today. At issue, wages and staffing. The paramedic union says over the past few years, salaries have been lagging far behind both firefighters and police. And as Ron Benzie reports, if something doesn't change soon, paramedics in this province could soon start disappearing. We want respect! We want respect! They were loud and angry. Hundreds of ambulance paramedics put on their fluorescent vests and carried placards to highlight what they claim is their own emergency when it comes to wages and working conditions. They have no idea how far we've fallen behind. For other uh, brothers and sisters, the other emergency services. They don't care. They don't care, is right. And brothers and sisters, we should not and we must not wait to send a clear message to Gordon Campbell. And that message is, we're as mad as hell and we're not going to take it anymore. Yeah. The paramedics union says members' concerns are being ignored by senior managers, so they hoped by taking their protests to the provincial cabinet offices in Vancouver, the government will hear their message loud and clear. Union leaders tried to get into the building to deliver a letter outlining their concerns, but they were stopped by security. Frontline paramedics say they're overworked and underpaid, having to deal with a 0% wage hike for far too long. It's not just us that's at risk, it's the uh, public, because obviously with more calls in the public, uh, you know, that, that's calling into the 911 service, uh, we're, we're still stuck with the same amount of ambulances we had 10 years ago. We're not getting any respect, and I think today was a good example of, you know, everyone feeling the same way. It's, the things are coming to a head. People are mad. Six more months! But the government points out the budget for the BC Ambulance Service has risen 57% over the past seven years to $283 million. BC's health minister says today's rally was simply a noisy way to kick off the collective bargaining process. They'll be raising a great many issues, and that's not surprising. That's what we do in collective bargaining discussions is, uh, is to air out all of those issues. So I do look forward to that, and I and I demonstration today is uh, one of the ways in which they're attempting to get our attention. How successful paramedics will be doing that remains to be seen. Their current contract runs out in six months.